Hey, I'm Laura. Just quickly, we here at Grit TV are proud to bring you independently produced content every day. Now it's your chance to help us. Grit TV has been offered a $100,000 challenge grant. Every dollar you give right now between now and June 30th is worth $3 to us. We've only got a few more weeks to meet the match. Will you help? You can donate at our website, grittv.org. Meanwhile, enjoy this clip. One million dollars per year to keep one United States troop in Afghanistan, and 850 of Afghanistan's children die every day. And how much money does the government officer in your average region in Afghanistan, not Kabul, mm -hmm. have to try to implement these development and uh, democracy programs? We're well, if you break it down on. to the district level, there are 364 districts in Afghanistan. A district governor earns $70 a month. And his operating budget is $15 a month. Now, juxtapose that to the United States taxpayers paying $1 million to keep one soldier in Afghanistan for a year. Uh, and, and, you know, with NATO also, if, if, if you, one other statistic is that uh, Italy spends a million dollars a day to keep the Italian contingent of NATO soldiers in Afghanistan. And I, we were um, guests of the very fine. NGO called Emergency, which has been in Afghanistan since 1999. And, and one of the nurses, a, a young man with just tremendous compassion, said, Allah, what I could do if you give me a million dollars, you know, a day. And, and when you think about the, the privations, the, the, the effects of poverty all across that country, the scandal of building up the bloated defense budgets and also the budgets for some of the NGOs and humanitarian relief workers pay you know, large salaries for the Westerners. And even if they pay larger salaries to the Afghan workers, that causes inflationary mm. spending. 